Hello guys, welcome to my channel. My name is Bhageshri and I am back again with another tutorial. Today I am going to show you how I shampoo my hair, how I condition my hair to make a better use of conditioner, how I detangle my hair and many more related things. So let's get started. So now I am going to use Rikul anti dandruff shampoo on my dripping wet hair. I am going to take a half mug of water and going to add required amount of shampoo in it. After adding the shampoo, I will lather it up and only going to pour it on my scalp, not on length. While adding the shampoo, I like to massage my scalp to make my shampoo work properly. I'm going to massage it all over my scalp to make it clean. Now taking the remaining shampoo over my lens, little bit is enough. My hair feels dry when I add much more shampoo because I use Kitikonozal shampoo too. So it makes my hair more dry. So that's why I prefer using less shampoo. Now I am washing my hair thoroughly with plain water. After this I am going to condition my hair. I am using Riquil Murmuru conditioner, one of my favorite. Taking one dollop for each side. Adding little water to emulsify it. Now going to apply it all over my hair length. This is how I apply my conditioner and I make sure it reaches my every hair strand. Taking another dollar for second section. Going to apply it again in the same way. Avoid using conditioner on the scalp. Apply it on the length only. Again applying it all over my hair not on the scalp Okay, so I am almost done. Now I am going to tie my hair in a bun. Now I will wait for 3 minutes. After that, I am going to detangle my hair. So it's uh, done almost. Now I am going to detangle my hair. Now my hair is completely ready for detangling. I'm going to detangle with Zocal's comb. This one is now one of my favorite. Don't comb directly. Before that, I'm going to add little bit of water. Now I will start detangling my hair. I'm going to start from the ends. by going upwards slowly. To show you guys properly, I am uh, I have sectioned my hair. You can also do more partitions to make it easy.
go so gentle while detangling to avoid extra breakage. I haven't edited this part. I have added the full clip so you can see actually how I detangle. My back hair section get more tangled always so I make sure I go slowly while detangling it. Now I have fully detangled this part. Combing it through to make sure there is no tangle left. Whatever hair fall you see while detangling and styling, it's all normal. Now I'm going to detangle my second section. Starting in the same way. This is my hair fall after detangling. This is how I detangle my hair and hope this will help you all. If you really find it helpful then don't forget to like it. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you want to see more related videos. See you in my next videos. Till then bye bye.